Imagine waking up to find out that everything you know, every person, object, and sensation, could be nothing more than a highly advanced computer program. Are we all part of an intricate simulation crafted by an unknown intelligence? This isn't just science fiction anymore. Leading scientists and thinkers, including renowned astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson, are seriously considering the idea that our reality might be artificial, with clues emerging that could point to the truth. Today we'll uncover 10 of the most unsettling signs that reality as we know it might be nothing more than lines of code. 1. The strange precision of physical laws. One of the biggest mysteries of our universe is the precise nature of physical laws. These laws, from gravity to electromagnetism, seem almost perfectly tuned for life to exist. Why is that? Some scientists suggest it's because these rules were coded into the very fabric of our reality. This precision, they argue, could be evidence of an intelligent designer setting up conditions like a programmer creating a balanced game environment. If our reality were a simulation, then these laws could simply be part of the programming, maintaining consistency across the board. Think of it as the rules of our universe's code. This would mean that everything we experience, from the way particles interact to the force of gravity, could be predetermined to create a stable environment for us to live in without us even realizing it. This level of precision raises the question, if these laws are fine-tuned, then could it be by design? It's unsettling to think that we might just be existing within a set of rules programmed to appear natural, but are in fact artificially constructed boundaries. Two, digital physics and the smallest possible unit. Researchers in digital physics are finding evidence that there might be a smallest possible unit of space and time, almost like the pixels of a digital image. These units, known as Planck lengths, can't be divided any further, which would make sense if our reality was created on a grid-like structure, much like a computer screen. If space and time were continuous, they should be infinitely divisible, but the existence of this smallest unit suggests that our reality might have been rendered at the quantum level. This pixelation effect might be the equivalent of the pixels we see in digital screens, suggesting we could be living inside a simulation with limited resolution. This isn't just theoretical. Experiments are being conducted to search for signs of pixelation in cosmic rays. If confirmed, it would mean that reality has a resolution limit, a clue that what we see as smooth and continuous might actually be broken into discrete points like a digital image. 3. Quantum mechanics and uncertainty. The behavior of particles at the quantum level defies the logic of everyday experience. Particles appear to exist in multiple states at once and only choose a state when observed. This bizarre phenomenon, known as quantum superposition, seems like something out of a video game where objects don't fully exist until they're needed. In a simulation, it wouldn't make sense to render everything fully all the time. By only rendering particles when they're observed, a simulated reality could conserve computational resources. This idea has led some scientists to theorize that the behavior of particles is actually a form of on-demand rendering, a concept that makes sense if our reality is just a complex program. If our universe behaves this way, it could mean that reality itself is lazy loading, bringing things into full existence only when necessary. It's a chilling thought that parts of our reality might exist in an incomplete state, only to be filled in when we look closer. Four. Glitches in reality, the Mandela Effect. Many people around the world recall the same false memories, like the belief that the children's book series The Berenstain Bears was once spelled Berenstein. This phenomenon, known as the Mandela Effect, has left people questioning whether our memories are somehow being rewritten or if we're living in alternate versions of reality. In a simulation, what we perceive as glitches could simply be errors in the programming. Just as video games occasionally have bugs where characters or settings don't appear as they should, could our reality occasionally glitch, causing false memories or strange occurrences that seem impossible to explain? If this effect is indeed a glitch, it suggests that our reality isn't as solid as we think. Instead, it could be a malleable environment where errors sometimes seep through, leaving us with memories of events that never happened. 5. The existence of mathematical reality. Mathematics describes our universe with astonishing accuracy. 
everything from the orbits of planets to the properties of light can be perfectly represented through equations. But why does math work so well? Some scientists argue it's because reality itself is built on mathematical principles, just like the algorithms in a computer program. If our reality was designed by an advanced intelligence, then it would make sense to use mathematics as the language of this simulated environment. This would explain why math doesn't just describe the universe, but seems to be woven into its very foundation. Could it be that math's omnipresence is a clue that we're living in an artificial environment built on code? If so, then every equation we uncover might be a glimpse at the universe's programming language. 6. Information Theory and Reality's Code According to some physicists, information could be the fundamental building block of our universe, more basic than matter or energy. In fact, every interaction and exchange we observe could be viewed as a transfer of information. This has led some to theorize that the universe might be a gigantic computational system, processing information according to a preset code. In this view, everything we see, touch and feel could be an expression of binary information similar to the ones and zeros used in computing. This would mean that our reality might not be built from particles and forces, but from data points manipulated by a powerful program. If information is indeed the core of everything, it's a hint that reality might function like software, where data is manipulated according to specific rules, just as in a computer simulation. 7. Consciousness as a programmed interface. Why do we experience consciousness? Some scientists propose that consciousness itself could be an interface created by a higher intelligence to allow us to navigate this simulated reality. Like a video game interface, consciousness might be designed to keep us immersed, giving us the illusion of free will while we're actually following pre-programmed pathways. This perspective suggests that our thoughts, emotions and choices might be part of a controlled experience, similar to how characters in games feel real to us but follow set patterns. If consciousness is programmed, it means we're experiencing a curated version of reality designed to keep us engaged and unaware of its underlying nature. The concept of consciousness as an interface raises profound questions. Are our experiences real or are they carefully crafted to feel that way? If we're in a simulation, it would make sense that our consciousness is part of the design. Eight, reality's consistency despite vast complexity. Despite the vast number of factors at play, reality holds a remarkable consistency. Seasons change, weather follows patterns, and natural cycles repeat with incredible regularity. This consistency has led some scientists to suggest that reality is like a well-maintained program, where the code keeps everything running smoothly. A true reality might be more chaotic or unpredictable, but a simulated one could be crafted to appear orderly. If reality is an elaborate program, then the consistency we see in nature might be a result of carefully set parameters that maintain order in a way that's pleasing and logical to its users. This orderliness could be a major hint that what we consider natural and inevitable might actually be predetermined, like a program's predictable output. 9. Time. A programmable illusion? The experience of time moving from past to future is something we take for granted. But some physicists believe time could be an illusion, a construct created to help us make sense of this reality. In a simulation, time could simply be another variable, manipulated to create a seamless experience for the inhabitants. What if time is merely a setting in the program, allowing events to unfold in a linear way that we perceive as natural? This would mean that time itself is a coded feature of our simulation, designed to make us feel like we're living through a series of unfolding events. The idea that time is programmed shakes the foundations of how we perceive existence. If it's not a fundamental aspect of reality, but a deliberate construct, then everything we understand about life's flow could be artificial. 10. The final test. Evidence of a creator. If our reality is a simulation, then somewhere out there exists a creator, whether that's an advanced civilization, a superintelligence, or something beyond our comprehension. Could we ever find proof of such an entity? Some researchers are looking for signatures in the cosmos, hints that might point to an intentional design. If a creator designed this simulation, 
then there might be evidence left behind, perhaps in patterns in the cosmic background radiation or unexplained forces that guide the universe's expansion. Discovering these signatures would change everything, proving not only that we live in a simulation, but that we were purposefully placed here by an intelligence beyond our understanding. The search for these clues is ongoing, but if found, they could finally reveal the terrifying truth that we are indeed part of a grand simulation. If you have made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.